Okay, so, got a few dents in our panels, um, just from racing incidents before, so I'm just going to use a little sanding pad, rub this down slightly, just over the bumpy bits. There's some other bumps here and there, but I'm just going to do the main bits because that's where we're going to put a sticker, and it would be nice if the sticker didn't look all ripply, so I'm not really concerned about making a huge difference to, you know, making it perfect. Um, it's going to get more dense at some point. So literally, just rubbing it down, just to make it key. I'm going to clean off all that dust, and then put some filler on, and Bob's your uncle. Like the McQueen's your aunt. So hopefully, this will be quite straightforward. Um, it doesn't have to be perfect, so yeah, it should be quite quick, and uh, the end result should be good enough that you know you don't really notice. And uh, we're going to get more knocks and bumps anyway, but at least from a distance you won't see all these ripples. So I've got some of this um, eyes upon filler that I just happened to have in the garage. Um, just need a little bit of hardener. Hopefully this hasn't gone completely off. Since I used it last. A little bit of hardened there. So it should be a, a pea sized amount versus uh, a golf ball. So let's get that out. Let's try and mix that together quickly. Be able to literally fill in the gaps, hopefully, nice and easily. It's a bit like anything like this, it's tricky is not to keep playing with it too much, although you want to smooth it out straight away, it's not the best idea. That would probably be enough. Um, and that does just look a lot flatter than it did. So I've just filled it. Um, the main, well, the main part of the uh, the dents are filled now. Um, it's probably not very good. I've only used some very coarse paper like 40 or 60 grit so far. Um, I just want to get some paint on it just to see how close it is to being roughly like a, a normal wing shape. Um, so I'll just do that initially on a very thin coat and then um, see what we need to do from there. How much more shaping we need to do and rubbing down before we do the final coat. And try not to spray it too far out of the area that I've filled um, because it'd be a bit of a pain then. And the, uh, the more I spray, the more I'm going to run out of paint and have to blend in further areas so I'm just going to try and keep it small and uh, hopefully be a lot of stickers around this area so all we want to do is make it so that it's not really bumpy where the stickers are to be honest I don't want to go crazy with this, it's just very very simple, easy, cheap repair See how that goes, and uh, hopefully, won't have to do too much more to that other than put a bit of red on. Uh, maybe just fill a little few bits. I'll see what the other side's like, and then we're, we're good.